Now this question has a uh, missing assumption over here. So in the pie chart where geometry is involved, so for example this 90 degrees represented by the right angle. Alright, so in this question I'm going to assume that the lines that we see here, okay, I'm going to label down the alphabets. So A, B and C, D are straight lines. Okay, so it means that since they are straight lines, this angle here in the holic sector would be the same as the other sector. Okay, so the number of students who like T okay, is half. Okay, so this would take like one unit. Those who like holics would be two units. Right, so I'll put down one unit over here. Okay, holics put on my two units. And since we say that the angle on the other sector side is the same, so this should be two units as well. Okay, and CD is a straight line. Okay, so notice that since this is a straight line, this is 90 degree. All right, so if you could cover this part here, so this part will be 90 degree, this part will also be 90 degree. Okay, the T sector and the other sector will be 90 degrees as well. So that accounts for one quarter of the total. Okay, so one quarter of the total will represent three units. Okay, and since we got one quarter, we can find half of it. Okay, by multiplying by two, so that will give us six units. Okay. And it's given 132 pupils like Milo. So those who like Milo plus those who like Holics would also be half of, okay, of the entire pie chart that you see here. Okay? So we can write down 132 pupils plus Holics, two units. Okay, so this is the Milo, this is the Holics. And this gives us total 6 units because it's half of the entire pie chart. So we can clearly see that this part here will be 4 units. 132, we can find 1 unit first. Alright. Okay, then we can simply take half times 2. So the entire pie chart would be a whole, would be 1 whole, which is represented by the total number of pupils required to find out in the question, so six units whole represents the entire pie chart, so it takes up double of this, so 12 units, you can just straight away times 12 to give you 396.